What would you say if I told you this could one day look like this? For as long as all of us have been alive, the Sahara Desert has been, you know, one of the driest places on Earth. And so reading that it's going to be greener and wetter in the future is a little bit surprising. Researchers predict parts of Africa could see 75% more rainfall by the end of the century. As we see these atmospheric circulation patterns begin to shift around, that means some areas that were drier before will become wetter and some areas that were wetter before actually become drier. But that's kind of the thing about climate change is, you know, the more the climate changes, the more places are gonna look a lot different than what we're used to. For the Sahara, these shifts could be catastrophic. Obviously flooding is going to be a major concern, especially for a place that really sees barely any rainfall, even a little bit can cause a lot of changes and a lot of issues. And that's gonna change what kind of crops you can grow. It can change what kind of animals can live there. I think the most alarming projection that could come out of what the study is talking about is actually its effects on hurricane season. More rainfall is falling in this desert. That means that the dust is gonna be wetter and harder to loft into the air. So if not as much dust is being lofted into the air, that means not as much will be transported over the Atlantic Ocean. Normally as a meteorologist, I can take that kind of breath of air when the dust plume comes off the Sahara desert because that means the storms are going to be suppressed, we're going to have a little bit of a quiet period. And so if we don't really have that in the future, I can't even imagine you know, how active these seasons are going to look and how many more devastating impacts we'll see.